Some national leaders say it's a step that will help millions of salaried employees. Good evening, I'm Kim Chapman. And I'm Josh Rowe. Two years ago, President Obama signed an executive order for the Department of Labor to change the overtime law. Yesterday, he announced those regulations will go into effect later this year. Brittany Nicholson joins us now with more on this story. Brittany. Josh Kim, Vice President Joe Biden said today these regulations hadn't changed since Ronald Reagan was president. While some say it's great for an overworked employee, one local business says it can hurt the employer in the long run. More American workers will soon be able to reap the benefits of working overtime. A new federal regulation requires employers to pay a salaried employee if they work more than 40 hours in a week. That's if they make less than $47,000 a year. Rhonda Champion, the CEO of PayPro HCS in Chattanooga, says this is long overdue. The overtime um, levels, uh, the, the salary levels that have been in place, have been in place for since the early 70s, and they've not been addressed since then. So this, this ruling has probably uh, been necessary for a very long time. Vice President Joe Biden said Wednesday it will help millions of overworked middle class Americans. You're working 60. 70 hours a week and you're not getting compensated for it, you're also losing the opportunity. You'd have your old working 40 hours a week to improve yourself or to spend time with your kid. While Champion agrees it's great for an overworked employee, she says many small businesses could feel the effects of the change. It's going to be challenging for certain businesses to understand how this is going to have, what the financial impact is going to be for them, because many of them don't track how many hours that their salaried employees are working. She says many businesses may have to shuffle hours and employees around to follow the new regulation. If we've got an employee that's making $45,000 but working 60 hours a week, is it going to be better for us as an organization to raise their pay to $48,000 and then exempt ourselves from the overtime rules? Before now, any salaried worker who made above $23,000 a year was exempt from overtime. The law will go into effect in December. Josh. Brittany, thank you. The regulation also says a salary threshold can be adjusted every three years depending on U.S. income growth.